Hello there, my name is Jordan. I work for Airboxer in the Growth and Community team. Today I wanted to show you uh, an exciting new feature we've added to our plugin, uh, air hops. Air hops are a bit like uh, a macro in Excel. Um, and uh, today I wanted to show you a demonstration of our first installation, which is the marketing hop. So without further ado, let's launch the Airboxer plugin. And I will show you how we can uh, use the marketing hop uh, to get a quick overview of data from the last 30 days um, across a variety of connected sources. Quite similar in a sense to a dashboard in the oversight that you get. So we'll uh, launch the air hops here. The first time we do it, you are given a link to a template which, which serves as the template for the dashboard. So let's just go and do that now quickly. Um, so it comes up in a new tab like this. And uh, you'll notice that this is a this is a read-only uh, copy. So what I'm going to have to do is uh, go straight to file and make a copy. Um, you'll notice also that there's uh, instructions on a separate page. So feel free to read through those if you prefer to the video. Uh, so we'll go to make a copy. And it doesn't really matter what you call it, but uh, we can go. Help demonstration. And now I'll just make a quick copy for us. Fantastic. And then once you've made your copy, launch the Airbox plugin again. You don't have to do this once. Then when you have your, your, your dashboard, that's now good to go. So um, in future, you just launch the plugin on this uh, template that you've, you've made a copy of. So, go to the air hops again. I'm just going to get the dashboard tab up. Fantastic. So, this is just a template. These numbers uh, aren't representative of our campaign. So, I'm going to uh, um, click the marketing hop. It will clear the data and effectively compile information from our connected sources. So, this is Google Analytics, Facebook ads. Uh, Google Ads. Um, so, so it's uh, a variety of information. Also, here you can uh, choose date parameters. So, for example, um, you can tap to uh, select the date value that you want to find for your campaign. So, for example, if you're only interested in stuff from the previous week for a weekly review meeting. So that would be a, a feasible example of, of how you might use the air hop. Uh, uh, it simply clears the, the values. And now it's, it's doing a, just a, a chain of imports, really, um, and a few calculations and, and graphical representations to make it uh, much more digestible information, perfect for a quick oversight um, and uh, just kind of at a glance information over the last 30 days or based on the parameter you set. Um, so to change the, the start or end date, you simply double click on the box and choose from the drop down calendar. So that was uh, a demonstration on how to use air hops. Um, I hope you found it interesting and uh, thank you for watching.